year, by the way. <laughs> but uh, we're going to be giving some that's very, very, very inexpensive for you. But, uh, you know, it's uh, not the goal. It's just here. So uh, if you'd like to be a practitioner, let us know. We have Ascension Psychics Magazine. It's the Paranormal Game Connection. And uh, love and light, everybody. And if you'd like to join me, just uh, look for me here, this channel, Cosmos Radio Org, TJ Mars ET Radio. And uh, we may stay over for just a few moments or a little bit on our recording, so love and light. And uh, join us weekly here on Thursday nights, popular show. Join us Saturday, Sunday, and uh, come back and hear what we're talking about and be a part when it's Thursday night's panel night. So if you want to come and show up, it'd be great. All right. Well, I lost uh, Mary Lou, so uh, Mary, apologize for that. Uh, it, or she dropped off again, or she was going to hit a button to talk again, I guess. <laughs> but thank you, John, uh, Bill, uh, everybody, for joining us, uh, Mary Lou and Sherry. Uh, we can uh, have you, uh, everybody, if you want to join ascensioncenterchurch.org. Uh, there the articles and bylaws are out there. You can read it. If you want to get, go to their association, a group, uh, a church in your area, whatever it is that you're called to do, listen to your higher guide and your spirit for upt- uplifting humankind. We're a spiritual and education uh, group. And uh, find your, your spot and get to know us. And It's all about uh, fellowship and how you fit in with our organization's And we have different ones. So look at ascensioncenterchurch.org. Look at ascensionpsychics.com. We have goalsoulfirst.us. And uh, we've got, of course, mine is cjmorrisacir.com. And uh, I'll come back and do some readings if you just want to have some tarot readings. And we'll get to know Sherry, too, with her degree and where she fits in. Uh, But, Sherry, think about being an anchor and, uh, you know, people that are anchors, they just they show up and they do their part. So no matter what, other people know they can count on them, folks. And, and right. John Drockton's been an anchor for me for years. Instantly you can experience uh, uh, the more you come and practice, the more you learn. But you also learn that people appreciate you being conscious. <laughs> and sometimes people just have to show up for the universe. So uh, people that anchor, sometimes they're auditory. Uh, Sometimes they just are using their uh, senses, and it's a positive feeling you have about being around them. They have special places in the universe. And, you know, angels have special places, messengers do, and uh, light workers do. And uh, a lot of the light workers will be around you, and you don't even know they're doing what they're doing, but they're doing it. And they have good positive energy. So uh, we'll go into all that, and we'll help you find your place. So, uh, Sherry, I hope you feel comfortable. And uh, we had an interesting night, so we know sometimes when people show up, I got to hit like Sherry did. I think they were just traveling in teams. Uh, Sherry, <laughs> are, have you, are you familiar with Blog Talk? Have you been on yes. Blog Talk before? I have okay. a little well, show. You know how- on, yeah. What's your show? Um, it's Sherry, the Mystical Goddess show on Sundays at four, and um, I do the same thing. I, I talk about some topics, but usually the energy kind of dictates the show, and I like it that way. That's fine with me. Good. Well, no, great that you got a blog talk. Yeah, we've got several people that have different shows, and uh, we network here. We're a big social metaphysical network. And so Sunday's at 4 o'clock, and you can always come and mention that. Central, yeah. And, and I'm looking at your site, and I'm going to do some navigating because you've got a lot of sites here and a lot of information. Um, so far it looks I'm not, you know, looks like what I think it would look like for metaphysics, but I've got to I explore and kind of and see where everything is. But you've got a lot of places for a lot of people. I can see that. <laughs> okay, well, Ace Metaphysical Institute, like we don't have one name, uh, uh, and I'm not sure why that is yet. I don't know. Ta- Bill, why have, you know, in four years we've got Alien mm-hmm. Contact Org, and we've had Ascension Center, and then we have the Ascension Psychics, and we have Ascension Center Church. But what it is is we started with one. I did have the original AscensionCenter.com in the United States uh. of America and the world. 
and I let it get away from me, and then I had other groups. So we've got Ascension Center Network, ascensioncenter.net network over in Hawaii. But through the years, it doesn't matter anymore whether you've got .com, .ca, .anything is uh, having a presence. And people are using mostly social media, Facebook now, groups on Facebook, and they don't, you know, if you're going to have a business, you need a website and social media. And a lot of the PhDs may have their classes online, but they don't, uh, some of them don't even want to do uh, their Facebook pages. They don't post or anything. So these are things we all need to think about, is how are we going to have our cyberspace presence? And uh, Sherry's got her own radio show on Sundays at 4 o'clock, so that's good. You just do one uh, one a week or what, Sherry? Um that one's got the producer on it, um, and I have my own little station where sometimes I'll just go on and do a 30-minute reading show here or there. Um, yeah. You know, because okay. somebody needs to talk, and sometimes I'll feel that, and I'll pick, go on and pick up, and sure enough, there'll be people. And um, But like I said, I'm finding my niche, and I've got other things going on, like we all do. Yeah. It all fits in together on your path, and so I'm trying to, you know, figure out what is this path going to look like for me. And like I said, I know about the healing and the readings and the metaphysics. Right. They're already well equipped to bring tools to the table, so thank you for that. Right. Well, if you want to join with us, we've got our articles and bylaws up, and I tell people it doesn't matter what state you're in, just... You know, let me know who you are and what you're doing, and we'll be more than happy to link you in and put your link up for what you're about and what you're doing. Everybody out there, let's let us know. And uh, we'll be here, and uh, we have articles and bylaws that we follow to be proper, and uh, you can reach them on just about every one of my websites uh, that I have. But you can look at ascensionpsychics.com, ascensioncenterchurch.org, are the two more spiritual groups, and go so first uh, U.S. And uh, Bill, have you been posting any articles lately? If you're a writer, folks, you can be known for a syndicated columnist and writing on certain things. If uh, I'm a writer, I have several books. If you're interested on Amazon.com, yeah. Sherry, you may want to go look at some of my books okay. uh, on Amazon. Uh, Teresa J. Morris. Anybody else out there? And uh, Bill's working on us some uh, books and uh, at the universal level and the open walk and a workbook on that. So if any of you guys are out there authors, there's so much to do in this life. We want to just get you involved and see what you're good at and see what your gifts are and get you plugged in. And now I've got more time than ever now that my husband's passed. So, Anna, is there anything you want to be known for with our group, other than you're doing tarot readings and your herbs? Have you written a book yet on herbs? Hmm. Can you write, Anna? Oh. <laughs> um, no, I do a lot of different things I don't know right now. I'm trying to pack for tomorrow. <laughs> oh. oh, what are you? Are you going somewhere? Yeah, I have this um, in between job, and um, oh. and it's a, a at a paint painting. Uh, some I'm doing some work along with an artist, and uh, so it's so I'm packing for. I want to take a gym class, paint for two hours, take a gym class, and then go back to the site. And the site my is goodness. on the Upper West Side, Upper East Side, and my gym is on the lower like. West Side, so it's kind of like. Oh wow! But I'm gonna to try to do it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah Whoa! Do you hear that? Tomorrow. Wow, yeah. that's awesome. So. Yeah. Uh, talk about energy mover, Anna. My goodness. So painting, gym, painting, gym. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. Painting, gym, and then painting, and then home. Oh, okay, know. painting, gym, painting, home. Still, what a busy day you have. That's quite an interesting. Uh, yeah. I don't know. Twenty four hours. Maybe well, again, I congratulations. Should, you know. Do you think I should go to the painting again after I finish my gym, or just go home? It depends on your energy. If it's high, yeah. May, it, it's, if it's high, if you haven't forget it, get, forget, uh, finished, you know, it's yeah. uh, 
Exactly. It's however your I'm energy, because you're the only one in that body. Uh, I, yes. It sounds like something I would do, but I would plan it. Yes. But if I didn't feel like it, I wouldn't do it. That's a balanced life. Yes. You do whatever yeah, your energy dictates. Yeah, that's how I feel. Yes. yes. Thank you. So, you bet. Uh, yeah, that's good. Yeah. Good like energy. That. Yes. Yes. Go with the balance of what you know. If you feel like it, do it. Exactly. If it feels good, exactly. do it. <laughs> yes, if, if it doesn't, if it feels like out of balance, I got to get out of there. That's yes. right. That's yes, right. Yes. Too much. You can have That's high standards. You've got a good yes. energy, but you're setting high standards for tomorrow. I wish I had your I energy. <laughs> I am setting high standards for myself. I, I, I was um I was home for almost a whole week because I my left foot got injured, very very mildly, nothing serious. But I have just these. I'm just itching to go to work. I'm just dying to do something and not to be home. Well, you've got a part. good day planned to be out. So congratulations exactly. for getting that organized and. You, you your job will be there when it's supposed to be there. We all know how all yeah. that works. Yeah. So yeah. stay focused yeah. on what it is you want. It's very good, folks, to know your map your life and plan it. Yeah. You know, plan. Well, mm-hmm. they say failing to plan is planning to fail. So plan exactly. your future. And we're plan. all uh, put practitioners. Put out there. Yeah, put some intention out there and, and – do a lot of imagery. That's right. Yeah. We're all astral entities, but here, while we're here in the physical flesh, you're directing that body. You are just like the driver in the car. You're the spirit yeah. in the in the atoms and the neurons and all of that. So do your best yeah. to go with the flow. Do but be in charge as much as you can be, but stay yeah. balanced. <laughs> yes, it's stay a delicate balanced. balance. Stay balanced. Too much is too much. Yeah, we gotta yeah. we gotta watch ourselves sometimes, you know. Uh, so yeah, well, I'm gonna take it easy, but I'm also gonna try to get some things done. You know what I mean? So that I have some money do. and can do things with my money again. Mm-hmm. So basically, that's the plan, the master yeah. plan. Well, that's the beauty of nature, that's- isn't it? The divine will, and you can work with God's source and yourself. It's sort of a yeah. delicate balance, and also have the universal spirit or the still small voice or the Holy Spirit, whatever you want to call it, that yeah. works with you in the universe. So we can all find our answers, but it's always good to have a little support, and we're here for that, folks. Oh, we're your support, support system, is important. You know. Support is there's nothing mm-hmm. without it. <laughs> the good foundation has support, doesn't it? <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, well, I'm glad yeah, I can be here for you. Like I mean, well, folks, support comes in yeah, many different ways. Support yes, comes in, in God, from God. You know, you That's ask right. and you receive. Mm-hmm. That's the support. And Blog Talk Radio is always available. Mm-hmm. <laughs> There's so, a downpouring of energy. Yeah. The nature of law. Yeah, we're well, happy with you know, Blog Talk. I'm very happy. It stimulates my mind. It gives us activities. Yeah, we can, it can help us with our energy, help us get focused, yep. and yet sometimes, sometimes gives us things to sleep on and uh, intuitive knowledge, uh, knowledge and information. And I'm just amazed he keeps it going. I don't know what we're going to do when Blog Talk is no longer, so let's not think that. Let's mean? be willing to prepare. Who, the, who said that? <laughs> There's other yeah. places. If that happens, there will be somewhere else that's to true. go. There's Are already sure other that's not, There's no gossip out there that that's going to happen even. So even the thought is just like uh, cancel, cancel, yeah. clear. Still <laughs> vibrations of positive energy and experience, but we also want to always remember how life goes. There's ups and downs. But, you know, yeah. sometimes you have a stumbling block, but, you know, uh, being a rock in the road, we somehow may stumble, but sometimes we learn to kick it out of the way. So sometimes the best way to do it is to be active and not have any thoughts. But, you know, it is being prepared. So everybody just think of your divine visions and your experiences and how to, to uh, divine well, how to know what's going to happen and, and divine well by being prepared, well, being awake. yeah. The only thing you can depend on is God. Well, independable. 
Life has changed. Yes, 